A horrific fire Thursday night forcing over 100 residents and staff members at the Citadel Muse West Retirement Home in St. Albert to evacuate. Everyone in the building has been accounted for and three residents have been transported to hospital. The remaining were transported to a nearby hotel for the night. The fire is so big, not only did firefighters help with the evacuation, St. Albert residents also jumping into action. Everybody was just running and helping. And it was great for the, to see the community help get the senior center safe. Clint Hollinger lives close enough that he could see the smoke from the fire from his home. He's also a member of the City News team. He jumped right in to rescue seniors from the flames. The flames were massive. There was one part of the building uh, that was that was coming off of the building. There was still seniors on the second floor that they needed to bring down. So there was probably about uh, you know 40 citizens in there helping out as much as I could just bring seniors down the stairs by hand. One of the residents evacuated from the building was Roy, saying he realized something was wrong when he heard the fire alarms go off. I kind of got up, like, looked around, you know. And the nurses came right away and they said, come on, down, fire in the building. So that's where they went. His daughter keeping him company after the evacuation. My mom called us because she lives in the next building and uh, she called us and let us know that she was evacuated. So we just came right over and found her standing outside of the building waiting for my dad. But we, we couldn't find him in the chaos, but uh, we found everybody and we're okay now. So that's the main thing. Now what's behind me is what's left of the building. As you can see, there is a lot of damage and fire crews remain on scene Friday afternoon to ensure all of the hot spots are out. Now what caused the fire to leave more than 100 residents without a home is still under investigation. At this time, there are no estimates on the damage caused by the blaze. If you have a loved one who has been affected by the fire and need to get in touch, you can contact the number at the bottom of the screen. In Edmonton, Laura Kroos, City News.